I was across the street from his house, and then after that, everything happened so quickly. I stepped out onto the street, immediately getting pinned by Nicholas's it's headlights. It's my fault. I should have been more... Oh, you probably shouldn't have been speeding, either. I told you I'm really sorry. Oh, we know you're sorry. You're a sorry son of a bitch. Mm -hmm. But you haven't finished the rest. I mean, why, why would... You... You're not one to walk out the traffic. Well, I have to admit, I mean, I, I was a little distracted. Ordinarily, I'd call it even and not throw stones, but this situation isn't ordinary. Right, well, you still haven't told us why you were so eager to go to Lucky's. Why? I need to speak to Nicholas alone. Oh, God, I don't think that's a good idea. I'm asking you to step outside. Okay. So... If he wanted Lucky to know the truth about Elizabeth and me, it'd already be done, so what do you want? Not you. But you want something. You're right, Nicholas. I do want something, and you're gonna make sure I get it. Lizzie. A lot of mistakes since I've been in Port Charles. And I'm beginning to realize that the worst was going after you when Lucky expressed interest in me. I mean, I didn't realize at the time how much better he is than you. See, I was focused on the end result, the money. <laughs> And then I made huge mistake number two. I fell in love with you. But boy, am I clear on that now. See, I get the difference. You're dark and you're moody and twisted and disgusting. And Lucky is positive and straightforward, loyal, sensitive, unselfish, and way too good for that slut that he's engaged to. Don't heap all the blame on Elizabeth. I'm the one who's at fault here. Oh, isn't that sweet, Nicholas? The way you're so willing to rush to her defense. You obviously want her. Fine. Yeah. Okay. Take your shot. I'm not gonna stand in your way. As long as I get my shot with Lucky. You honestly expect me to believe that you want to be with Lucky? Why is that such a shock to you? Because I think you're playing games. Again. Just looking for a way to hurt me and Elizabeth. Do you honestly don't think I could get him, do you? Don't kid yourself, Nicholas. All it would take is blowing the whistle on your sleazy little affair with Elizabeth and then being around to pick up the pieces. No, wait, see, so that, that wouldn't really do, because then I'd be the rebound girl, and I already did that with you. So you can take that petrified little look off of your face. I won't be telling your brother how horrifically you betrayed him. Not because of you, but because it gets in the way of what I want. Well, let me make sure I understand this correctly. You won't get in the way of me and Elizabeth as long as you end up with love. Oh, look at you, already drooling. This works out A-OK -okay for you, doesn't it? You get to keep having sex with your brother's woman as often as you want without pesky little distractions like remorse or guilt. You and that snake deserve each other. Lucky deserves better. <laughs> and what? And that would be you? <laughs> Saint little Rebecca who didn't try and run a con on me or sleep with Ethan well, when she was supposed to be alone with me? I wouldn't insult me if I were you, Nicholas. See, I'm going to be the one who's going to make it possible for you to get what you want, however long that lasts. So just don't get an attack of conscience and try to spoil this for me, because if you do, I swear, I will bury you and your little slut, too.